warm welcome to you in this Expressivo's music technology video number 31. I'm Marshall Shaw with more music creation ideas to help celebrate the arts in you. In today's video, I will be discussing a file format that goes well beyond MIDI, which I grew up with, called Music XML. This magical gift of technology allows digital composers to share their scores with other apps and software. MIDI is a wonderful format for sequencers, but not as good for music notation apps and software. Music XML uses a common language to robustly encode lots of control data for playback of your note data and for print purposes. As of last year, Music XML was supported by over 240 music notation apps, including areas of notation, music OCR, which is short form for optical character recognition, and digital audio workstations, or DAWs. The purpose of this video is not to show the native sounds of Dorico, Finale, Notion 6, and Sibelius, but for you to see the translation using the same music XML file in each software and highlighting the shortcomings of each. You will go away with hopefully a definitive answer on which software works the best in each conversion. For me, if the conversion is filled with mistakes, sometimes it takes longer to fix them compared with starting over in the new software or app. I'm sure there's a few of you that can attest to this. Our video will start with one finished example of a short piece I prepared in StaffPad. It is a fusion piece of neoclassical music with a brief classical opening of the traditional twinkle, twinkle, little star, then fused with a jazzy version moving slightly back and forth from classical to jazz. I'm highlighting StaffPad's Essential Drummers Library at a cost of 20 US dollars to test it out. I purposely made various challenges and pitfalls with this piece to test the music XML conversion to the other software, including two voices in one bar, clef changes, tempo and time signature changes, grace notes, triplets, glissandi, arpeggio symbols, bars of rest, and others. Following this, I will show you each conversion in alphabetical order, starting with Dorico, Finale, Notion 6, and Sibelius. So, let's start and find out which software offers the most stable musical XML conversion. We're going to start with Dorico Pro version 3. So, let's get going.
The final results. Notion 6 has created the most accurate music XML file with the minimal hassle or amount of corrections. These are my overall suggestions. Use the music software you like and learn it well. Each does the job with moderate amounts of corrections depending on the complexity of your score. Learn to set up your document to predict translation errors and avoid them. For example, if exporting a StaffPad file to Dorico Pro 3, I learned StaffPad's score must have whole bar rests in each empty bar. I hope you've enjoyed this video about the power of music XML files and how they embolden your music practice to move from one device and or software or app to another. If you find it easier to quickly notate your music in Dorico, Finale, Notion 6, Sibelius or StaffPad, you can exploit the capabilities of the best from each of these solutions to make your music creation even more fluid. My method for larger scores is to prepare them quickly in Finale or Notion 6, then send them by Music XML to StaffPad for its beautiful instrumental libraries, the perfect solution for me. Please take a moment to subscribe to support my efforts to continue to share music creation ideas on a regular basis. Also, most video compositions created here are placed on SoundCloud. Keep making music and celebrate the arts in you. See you soon in the next video. Take care.